Welcome back to the Brooklyn Brothers. Today, Chef Dom is going to show you how to make this flounder franchise. We got a side of green it's beans. A good dish. Yeah, we got a side of green beans, Italian style, also. A great dish for Lent. Anyway, let's get cooking. What are you doing? You're running away? <laughs> <laughs> what are you hiding for? <laughs> All right. Hello, everybody. We're, today, we're going to do a flounder franchise style with a lemon butter sauce to go on top of that. And we got some uh, fresh green beans. Right. right now, I'm going to show you how we do. I did, I did a lemon butter sauce. Throw some garlic in the pan, some onions, about three cloves of garlic, maybe a half an onion, small onion. This is going to be good. I used to do this all the time at Daddy Jack's for a special, for a lunch special. Get some wine in there. We're going to let, turn that on high. And we're going to let that reduce down. And then there's the cream and fresh lemon and salt, pepper and, and butter. Sounds Let's good. Put a few more onions in there. All right. We reduced our wine pretty good. Uh, now we're gonna add uh, cream to it. We wanna get that hot. You wanna put the lemon in last when the, when the cream is really hot because if you put it in now, it'll just curdle up the cream. It'll ruin the cream. Let that cook. A little salt. Usually I'll put white pepper in here. We don't have any white pepper. Uh, I'll just put a pinch of black pepper in there. You want that to get really hot. And we're gonna fold our butter in there. When are you gonna do that? As soon as it starts to bubble and put our butter in there. Huh? Add a quarter of a stick of butter. You can put more in there if you'd like. That's unsalted butter, right? Yes. Right. You want to keep stirring this so it doesn't overflow. So we can get hairy in there. It's okay if you get the seeds. I'm just gonna throw the whole thing in there. Yeah. How's it going, mother? Oh, nice. How long are we gonna let that cook for? About? Just a few more minutes. I'm gonna put a little more lemon in there. The skin is really thick on this one. Too much juice in there. Lemon juice, fresh lemon and lime juice, is a is a really good disinfectant, like anti antibacterial soap, better than antibacterial soap. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh yeah. Your yeah, grandma used to soak the chickens. And lemon. Lemon. Yeah. Oh. And fresh lemon. I remember. I remember that. She rub it down good and let it sit a while. Yeah. And then rinse it off. Yep. Nice. Ready? Yeah, just about. All right. All right. Okay, we're gonna start off now with, uh, we're gonna season now uh, our flour a little bit here with salt and pepper. You always wanna season your flour up a little bit when you cook it. Okay, we'll get our rings in here. And we're gonna just, uh, we're gonna do just salt and pepper and parsley in our egg wash. How many pieces of fish you got, about 10? Yeah. How's the wine, mother? Perfect. Do you <laughs> help? Uh, thank you very much. Uh, thank check, you, Dominic, and, you help. Uh, check out this beautiful 
Easter centerpiece my wife made. Okay. Beat. I raise a little bit here. The salt, pepper, parsley. We're gonna do our green beans real yeah. fast. We got some garlic in a pan there. All right, we're gonna put a little bit of olive oil, and I'm gonna add some butter to it too to fry out fresh green beans. Oh. Two tablespoons of butter. Right. Let that fry up. We're gonna add our green beans to here. We blanched off the green beans and a little salt and and water, boiling water, and then we fry them a little bit. Nice. Egg batter's ready. Flour's ready. Just got to get this pan nice and hot. You don't want your oil too hot in the when you're doing this because the egg will. We'll cook fast. Yeah. All right, we're gonna add our olive oil to the pan. And also we're gonna put some butter in there too. Butter. Unsalted butter. You gotta love it. We're oh, gonna go yeah. ahead and uh, salt and pepper. Fish. We need some room. We need a bigger we'll kitchen. Have room here. <laughs> Let's see what it is. Let's put that in there. Tight, tight quarters. Yeah. Believe it or not, the first Daddy Jacks. Uh, on Greenville Avenue in Dallas. The kitchen wasn't was smaller than this. Yeah, and it was and a commercial. Me and Jack were back there. <laughs> that was the only room for either one of us. Oh man, it was two of us back there. That was a small kitchen, man. Uh, I'm going to do a small piece first here to show you guys and dredge it in some flour. Beans going, how fish going.
bit of diced tomatoes in there too for a little color and flavor. Good right. green beans. Make sure you watch for bones in this fish, though. Yeah, well, you don't eat bread with that, then. All right. Because of the fish bones. Try. Actually, I need a knife. You need a knife to cut the fish? Mm-hmm. It's good. Is it good? Yep. All right. All right, thanks for watching, folks. Hey, we appreciate the subscribers. Hey, hit that notification button on the bottom, so this way we have a new recipe coming out. They'll uh, send you an alert. Anyway, thanks for watching. We'll see Bye. you next time. Take care.